Hello ladies and gentlemen and welcome to Valheim with Dwiz. Let's actually create a character here. I'm quite alright with that. Let's go for something like this maybe. And then we're done. Uh, so let's start a new world. Uh, we can actually remove both of these as I just did some testing. So let's create a new one with world. Done. And let's click start. I just skipped the intro text because I want to keep the videos quite short. Or I'll try at least quite hard in this game but I can already tell you so much our main goal is to come to Valhalla and to do so we'll need to kill all of these five bosses that's what he's telling us here the first one is going to be this one kind of a deer and here we can get the location, it's right there on our map, which is in the right hand corner, uh, upper right hand corner. And to start off, we'll need to gather some resources. And we also have a skill tree over here um, that will grow when we unlock further things. Uh, here, nice to find some raspberries. We can definitely eat those. Um, there is one deer which we will have to kill sooner or later. Uh, probably a whole lot of them as we'll need two of their trophies to offer on the altar that is marked on the map. Uh, for now, can we already... No, we don't have enough wood. So let us collect a little bit more of the wood. There we can craft a stone axe, really nice. And then we can actually cut down these little trees here. Uh, let me collect a little bit of wood here. These grailings are quite easy to handle. As you can see up there is the altar where we have to offer two of the deer trophies which we will get by killing them to uh, summon the boss over there and then we can actually uh, defeat him. So that's our next up goal I would say, uh, but to do so we'll need quite a few things. Uh, first of all we'll need to craft a hammer. With that hammer we can now build or start building things. Uh, we'll first need to place down one of these workbenches and let's actually think where we want to have our base. Ah, I think this is quite a good... it's only gonna be a small starter home so actually I don't care too much. Uh, 
Let's start with some flooring. Uh, can we do it a little higher, maybe? Something like that, maybe. Uh, that's three. We'll do, I guess, uh, two by three. I think that's... Well, let's actually maybe... Yeah, let's go for a three by three. Or even four by three, so I can show you a little bit of this lovely little game. We'll just put some walls here if we can. Nice. And then we'll put a door later on there, maybe. And or let's put the door here. And let's maybe get a window as well on two sides. And then here we will build a small fireplace, maybe. Let us continue on. We'll probably need a lot more wood to do. Build it, the whole thing here. But that should be alrighty. Uh, we can actually then maybe as well put this one for the looks and maybe have something like We'll need something like this first. And then I'll put on this one, I think. Like this, and for the looks again, I'll put these in. And then we should be able to put a fireplace down, which we will need in order to sleep in our bed, which is next, of course. Uh, let's sleep there. Then we will need a door. Uh, let's actually... Uh, let's... No, that was not correct. Here is the correct place. Nice. And then I wanted to put in a window. There are no real windows. But you can put these in and then it's kind of similar. And now we've run out of wood, which is not the best, but something we can do real quick as well is to put in our workbench to here. So we should be able to repair our things. Uh, so I'm going to go and grab some more wood. That's probably not gonna be enough for anything. But something else we could also do is get a better axe. That's uh, also on our to-do list, I guess. Sorry, Yugen, didn't want to kill you there. But I guess you're going to be back soon. As you can see, you can always only eat one thing of the type. Uh, let's head out here. I always find that to be easier to build these things from the outside. I don't know why. And where's the cross? There is the cross. Nice. So now our building is nearly finished. Like that. And we should be good to go in our lovely little home. And now we can spawn over here. Uh, it's not really far from our thing before, but it doesn't matter. Uh, next up on our list is definitely gonna be some flint. So we can actually 
get that better axe I was talking about. So we're heading back home here and probably we should have enough to get that axe I was talking about. Let us check. First of all, repair the stuff. There's our flint axe. That's nice to have. And then probably we can also upgrade it. No, we're missing the leather scraps. And to get those, we'll need to kill some boar. So let me go out and do that. And there I choked hard on the boar. Oh, actually, because I probably should have eaten a little more. Nice to see the first time how it's going to be dying. You're gonna die a lot in this game, in general. Okay, so now we have already six leather scraps. I think that's actually not enough. We'll need probably a little more. So we'll just go out and hunt for the next set of boars. Some mushrooms, that's really nice to have a second food source to get some more HP and also to boost our stamina bar. That's really important. There we have some deer, but they will be hard to get with the eggs. It's gonna be a lot easier with the bow. You can actually also sneak and then it's quite doable, but I think it's definitely worth it to get these leather scraps together, get the bow and stuff like that. There we have it and now we're at nine leather scraps. It's about half of what we need, I guess. Let us sleep through the night. That's gonna be way easier then. Why are you on my bed? Please go. Ah, we need a fire. Turn it on. Why does it not work? Never had that kind of a problem. Now it's working. First of all, let's get the bow. And that's it what we can do right now. So let's gather some more wood so we can make some arrows. So 
So let's try out this bow. Nice shot over there. Did I see another one? But actually boar are way easier, way easier to hunt with the axe in my opinion. But we'll need the bow for the deer. And when I see... Boar while looking for deer, of course I'll kill both. Because we'll need more leather parts uh, or leather scraps, uh, quite a lot more. We'll also need quite a lot more wood in the future. And everything. Quite an amazing setting, I think. Really love that game. There's another boar. In general, they don't run around alone, always in small groups like that. Most of the time I find them in groups of four or groups of five, uh, three, sorry. And there we have our first deer, uh, which is running around a little bit. There we killed our first deer. We got a deer hide and some raw meat, I guess. Finally, we got him. And it seems as if we've got our first deer trophy. And we've just entered the black forest where we can find copper, as we can see. And skeletons, and I think we're not really in the best state to fight them yet. As you can see, we're doing not a lot of damage to him. It's a little bit better with the arrows. Maybe our fire is also not the baddest, not the worst. And there is another thing going on. The Grey Dwarf, which is trying to kill us. Don't really want to mess with these right now because we have other stuff to do uh, she's still following us though uh, maybe we'll need to kill him And we died again. Mm. 
There we got another deer. And then on my way back here, I also saw something else that is really interesting for us. And we'll go there and get that. And we also got our second deer trophy. So, actually, no, let me show you this real quick. This is a bee uh, hive, and actually, if we shoot it, we can get a bee queen, as you can see. They can also harm you, so uh, be careful. Should have been careful here. Probably gonna die now. Oh no. Uh, not that bad. Uh, so now we can go back and get ourselves stuffed up to fight the boss. Nice to be home here. First of all, repair our items. Uh, maybe we get... We have the tunic, so maybe we'll get the pa pants as well. Uh, well let's, uh, let's have a look first. Can we upgrade stuff? No, we can't upgrade. Uh, we can get more... Why is that happening? shouldn't happen. Uh, it'll be fine. We'll get some more arrows. We'll probably need more wood. And we'll get the rag pants. <coughs> then we should be fine. Let's... Uh, I don't know why it doesn't work sometimes. Now it's working just need to do a roll. Maybe I'll need to put the bed on the other side. You dream of a river running uphill of green shoots turning downward into the earth. Now what's that mean? Uh, I don't know. Maybe we've had some kind of a weird dream. Uh, let's get some wood real quick to build something with our bee queen. Because you can actually use them to produce honey. And that's why they are quite valuable. As honey is quite uh, an important resource which we will need later on a lot. Uh, so let's look for that one. Nice, we have it here. Uh, let's just place it there, and then let's kill this grayling real quick. Nice one. And now something else we should need to make. Uh, we need to make, not should need to make. Uh, is Let's get those stones. Is we'll need one of these. Uh, and we'll just cook a little bit on top of that. And then we should be... We have to do something to this roof here. It's not working as it should. Let's just get rid of it. Or... Do we have a lot of wood? No. So let's not mess with that. And there our food is burning. And I'll definitely get rid of that bed in that position. That's really 
annoying. Let's put it here instead. Uh, or maybe here. I think that's a better place. Okay. Uh, let's get those out. And then can't reach back there. Ah, we, we already have four. That's nice. And then is there something else we can do? Uh, can we upgrade anything? No, we don't have the tear hides or the leather scraps. So let's just go and get a little food and then fight the boss. Okay, so now there is kind of an event spawn thing going on here. We have a couple of creatures spawning, so there's boar first of all. Um, which are running away quite fast. Then there's these necks. And a couple of other things. But now with the with the meat we should be we should be good against quite everything that this forest has to offer. Don't see any more creatures. Okay, the creatures are calming down. Uh, we now should have enough to make a chest so we can store some simple stuff. Uh, one's gonna be enough for the start, I guess. Let's actually just offer the items, uh, need to put them there, you make the sacrifice, and there we have it, where does he spawn, love the music and the sounds and everything, I just like to get a little distance in between me and him, As you can see, we will need to hit him quite often. Uh, so actually, this fight is way way easier if you have a partner if you're playing with friends on a server that's what i would advise you to do in general it just makes every aspect of the game easier and more fun of course He did quite a lot of damage there, but now I think we should be good to uh, win this fight. Don't do anything stupid here.
And now that should be the final arrow. And we defeated the boss, finally. There we have it. And that is gonna be the end of this episode. I hope you liked it. If you did, then please leave a like, comment and subscribe. And of course, see you guys in the next episode of Valheim or of course, I'm continuing my Factorio series as well. So if you're interested in that game, just go over there, check it out. That's like the main content of the channel until now. Uh, hopefully you guys like this series as well. So, see you guys next time, have a good one and stay safe. Bye!